Hey guys, how's it going? I'm Mega G Wolf, and welcome back to Let's Play Freedom Planet. And I've forgotten all the controls to every button ever, oh my god. For some reason, you know, because whatever, I can't remember simple controls over the... You know, amount of time it's been since I've played it last, why not? Ow, that was dumb. So this, this map is going to start getting a little bit more crazy, and I should try to time stuff better. But I'm just going to use the invincibility frame from uh, the special move, essentially. Hmm, I wonder if I was meant to collect that. I don't know, something didn't give me a hint or anything, so... I don't know. <laughs> but I've also got to find where the door is that I need to open to... Oh, that's the wrong way. Okay. But yeah, I need to find out where this door's going to be. It's going to be... down here, maybe? Oh, there it is. Hey! <laughs> Abuse the iframes! Oh wow. Snarky motherfucker. Oh god, here it comes. Oh, I feel the pain. I feel it. I feel the pain right now. You have no idea how much pain I'm feeling. In my body, in my soul, in my underwear. That's not always a good place to feel pain, by the way. Woo! There we go, we're good. Oh no, I meant to dash off of that. There we go. Whoa! Whoop! Can I not? Can we not? Okay, there we go. Oh my god. This gets absolutely insane. There's a lot of running in this one <laughs> in particular. Oh, what? Wrong way. Alright. Gotta use our boost. Well, we don't have to use the boost, actually. We could have just jumped, but no. I have to be fancy. I have to be all fancy-wancy. Schmancy-wancy. And so on, and so on. Oh, God. Whoa, where am I going? Uh, what? Whoa, oh, my God. Where am I? Ooh. Uh, okay. <laughs> I don't know how that was meant to go, but I don't think it was meant to go like that. Come on, fire you! Oh god. Burn! Yay, we made it out alive somewhat. Somehow. Oh, music did not loop properly in that, in that level. I did not know that, actually. That was a bit weird. Oh my god, there's so many enemies. Oh god, no, no, no. We need to get out of here right now. I hate these things. They're annoying. No, 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 no. Do not want, do not want. Do not want! My god, there's so much. It's just an onslaught. Nope, nope, no, there's two of them now. No, 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 no. I just want out. I don't want any part of that. Of course, I need another Xbox key to get through the Xbox door. And all that goodness. Oh my god. I forgot how crazy this gets. It's been a while. Alright, down. To our left. I actually got lost the first time I did this. I couldn't find the exit. Because I was an idiot or something. I don't know. No! No! Well, I gotta wait. Give me the goods, I guess. Why not? More extra lives could come in handy. Woo! Oh my god! So where do I have to go? I think it's up. Up this way? Yeah, there we go. Hey! We made it! Sweet! Oh. My. God. Now, I don't know if I'm going to have the same luck I had last time I fought this boss. Because the first time I fought it, it was um, actually a lot more powerful than this. Someone actually said in the comments, apparently the Serpentine boss that I fought on the last episode was actually nerfed quite a bit in Normal and Easy. 
which explains a lot because the first time I played this on day of release, I remember that boss being way more difficult. Like, ridiculously difficult. But it wasn't too bad when I fought it last time or in the last video, so. Alright. We've murdered one of her eyes and we can see inside her skull. Because this is a good game. Nice and kid friendly. <laughs> Not terrifying or creepy in any way. Oh my god, I barely survived that. We did it! Mila? Mila! <laughs> Boo! I was not expecting that. Okay. <laughs> well, I apparently did it really quickly. Ah, uh, here we go. We're actually reaching the final area now. This is essentially the last level, officially. But it's also the place I can show you something rather interesting. Now, this episode might be a bit shorter, because I don't know how much trouble the final boss is going to give me. Because, let me put it this way, I have 30 lives, I could easily lose him. <laughs> Honestly, the final boss, at least unless they've changed him, was very deadly and killed me a lot in the face. So, I, I do kind of want to not risk leaving this episode like 10 million years long. Of course, if the episode is like a good 10 million years long, it means I've completely ignored my own advice and have decided to try it anyway. So I guess uh, that will depend on the video length. <laughs> but we'll have to see. Oh man, if, if I can't make it up these simple platforms, then I guess we are going to be ending it soon. Okay, so in this area, we can actually do something interesting. This is going to kill me, by the way, so I'm doing this for your uh, your enjoyment and amusement. Providing I can even make it up there. Providing they haven't actually fixed this issue. So, in here, we have these things here. Which are going to teleport us down. And they, they get in the way. And they're all over the place. So, we have to maneuver around the area. And not run into them, basically. That's the idea. But there are certain ones that lead us to uh, a different path. The same, same kind of idea. But... They are not as uh, to the left. Oh, wait, have they moved them? Oh, I think they have moved them. I want to... Yeah, I think they did move it. Ha! Huh. They moved the one that gave the issue. I'm pretty sure, yeah. Wow, okay. In that case, I can't show you what I was going to show you. So yeah, it was a fun little glitch. I actually have a video of it uh, hidden away in my unlisted on YouTube of it happening. And I really need to check it again just to make sure that it has been changed or I just missed it. I might have missed it because it was a little while since I've done it. Well, there's an extra life I missed as well. I love this level, by the way. It's really cool how it all works. But uh, yeah, if I, if I think about it, I will edit it on screen. If not, I will at least try to put it in the description of the video so you can go and check it out. Uh, so that might be something a little funny for you to know uh, for you to know about. Of course, I'll be able to tell whether I completely missed it or if it's actually been changed. That'll be interesting to know. Ooh, I think there was health down there I could have got, but I completely forgot. I don't actually know, what is this? What is this laser? Like, what is the purpose of this laser? What is it actually doing? Because, like, you know, usually with a thing like that, it's like, you know, it has a, a purpose. But I'm trying to think what this thing can do, and I have no idea what it is. <laughs> like, what laser is it? What is it used for? I, I guess you don't need uh, a, a reason for it to exist, but... Whoops, hang on, wrong move. Almost got laser-fied there, that was the wrong move entirely. Wada! You know, 
Thank you to the person who, in the end, decided to convince me to try out the uppercut more, because it was uh, rather useful throughout the play playthrough. I uh, wasn't expecting to use it as much as I had, really, and so there you go. It's been very useful indeed. Also, it's really nice that these shields are here so I can try and protect myself a bit. Whoa, especially against that. Oh, oh yes. Oh, okay, I remember this bit now. Whoop! Oh my god, that was close. Woo! <laughs> I'm just uh, being an idiot now. But when am I not, though, right? When am I not? More health for me! So are we near the end? I think... Oh god, it's... I... Ugh, man, I'm nervous. All right, I'm nervous because I haven't fought this for this this fort in a fort and fought it fought fought me fought fought fought. All right, it's been a long time since I've fought this guy. Is what I'm trying to say. Yeah, it is the final bit. Oh boy, oh boy, this is bullshit. By the way, this this little gun turret thing because it just it takes pot shots at you and it takes your health away and it's annoying. I'll never forgive you. I have no use for forgiveness, especially from someone who puts my homeworld at risk for an oversized battery. I offer you one final chance. Leave. Now. I don't remember this bit. So be it. I do not remember that. Maybe it was there and it, because the amount of times you have to replay the, okay, yeah. This isn't going to go well, is it? The nice thing is, okay, this boss has three phases. The nice thing is, you get an auto save in between each phase. But I mean, I still gotta, I still gotta beat it. <laughs> that's that's gonna be one of the issues here. So yeah, this is gonna be uh, interesting. Okay, but yeah, I don't remember that being in there. Yeah, because it doesn't happen the second time. So I'm thinking that maybe I just I just played it so many times in the end that I forgot it existed. But we're going to be using the terrain to our advantage a lot. Oh my god. Damn it. I thought I'd be able to dodge that, but I can't. Now, you can actually keep an eye on the health of the, uh, of the enemies because of the little, like, lights that are surrounding the middle actually uh, lose light as I am damaging them. Ah! The only one that you don't get is uh, for the final boss, which actually you get an entire health bar separate for him uh, that you can see plainly on the screen. I'm not doing very well at this. Uh, I need to kind of concentrate on this guy because, yeah, no, this is this is like an actual boss that is going to kick my ass if I'm not careful. So I'm going to have to start actually focusing on this guy because, oh, uh, mm, and actually remembering to do, you know what, just kill me at this point, honestly, because that was a terrible start. I also got hit by the beginning laser. This thing is bullshit, by the way. You don't get when a boss beats you up like it like this one does you do not need something like this at the beginning of your stage just to take off health i feel like that is a cheap and nasty little trick there that i've not agreed with and pow so yeah i've got to fight this guy like i did the first time i ran into him oh I forgot what kind of moves he's going to use but I don't think he has as much health as the last one you fought. Woo! <laughs> ah, I thought I was going to be able to get a nice hit in, but I couldn't. Whoa, my god. Yay, I still got a hit in, though. No. Alright, we're doing well. Taking a bit of time, planning out your moves. I honestly think it's a really good strategy to, to survive against this guy. Because, I, like I said, I feel like he doesn't have as much health as he did in the previous fight. 
Yeah! I mean, you, you heal up a bunch anyway. So, that's phase one down. Now it's time for Mecha Brevin. Which is phase two. Now, I don't remember what this guy does. He lasers and doesn't afraid of anything. Oh yeah, and then he, he bounces around and doesn't afraid of anything either. He just doesn't afraid of anything. In general, I'm getting that feeling. And uh, the health bar is going to be... Oh, wait, what I... Oh, I had to be in the middle! Oh, okay, I have to be in the middle with him when he does that. So we're going to be starting at the... Yeah, the second phase now. I thought... For some reason, I thought we'd start at the beginning, but come here and the, the second phase would still be. So I don't have to worry about the little laser thing damaging me anymore, which is nice, actually. Beep, 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 beep. Instead, I've got to worry about his laser damaging me. Oh, wow, how'd I dodge that? I don't even know. Woo! Oh, gotta get... Damn it! No! That move is so powerful. Oh, my God. That move is just so deadly. I have to be in the middle when he does that. All right, you. All right, you. I got some good hits in. Then he got good hits on me. Huh? Can you stop with the laser, please? Ooh. All right. He's gonna do. I think he's gonna do the green. No. Oh wow, he didn't. I'm trying to expect him to do certain. Oh. Yeah, there you go. Here's a really good place to stand when he does that. Okay. Damn it. Oh my god. Oh wow, we got him. Nice. Alright, so. Third form down. Uh, third form now. Second form down. Third form now. <laughs> Worst form. The machines won't save you from the dragon you've unleashed. I will destroy everything you throw at me! I will make you pay for what you have done! Yeah, I do remember this. I do remember this voice acting, actually. I'd like to see you try. Woo! Okay, that's a really good start. <laughs> I wonder if they ever fixed the bug where, basically, he can kill you with a throw and you have... You're on your last life, like I am now. I'm just gonna die, by the way, because this fight is ridiculous! A nice added touch is if ever you go down normally, like if ever you... Shit, that is the worst! Oh, being hit by that at the beginning is the worst, by the way. It does so much damage! Oh my god. I should check. But yeah, if you get knocked down, but not destroyed, when you get knocked down, he will on purposely come after you and attack you. So I'm going to have to listen for audio cues. That, that particular move right there, he does a hya. That is the move I need to dodge all the time. All day, every day. If I do not dodge that, it's going to be the end of me. Okay. Whoop, yeah, we're good. Oh my god. Ah, damn it. You see, that does so much damage. Oh my god. Woo! I got thrown! Oh my god, it does so much damage, though. It does so much damage. <laughs> there you go, see, he came and finished me off. I have to make sure I do not get hit by this first one. Like that. Motherfucker. I mean, I could... I could beat him, technically, with this setup. It's just... It's hard, man. It's not easy. Whee! <laughs> I love being thrown. Ah, oh, no. What was that? I was hoping I didn't get hit, but... I wonder... I'm wondering if that... Uh, you know what? I should just... Yeah. I'm wondering if the throw still kills you when you when you have minimum health and get hit with it. Okay. Yeah, man. Dodging that move is such a bitch. Whoa! Ah, oh, no! You... You! Woo! Okay. I did really well the first time I fought this guy. 
And then it slowly went downhill after that. Well, okay, he's doing this move. I actually like him doing this move. Because he uh, leaves himself open quite a bit. Whoa! I don't know how I dodged that, but I did. Oh my god. No, I didn't have enough oomph in my bump to blah! Fuck you, buddy! Is she gonna do it from the right? And that's it. That's not only stage complete, that's game complete. And man, I did not expect to do it as fast as I did. Holy shit. It's okay. It's okay. I couldn't save it. I couldn't even stop him from getting away. Don't beat yourself up. Brevin didn't get the stone, and his army was destroyed with his ship. Thanks to you, our mission is complete. But at what cost? How are we going to survive without any more energy? Uh, Lilac, you might want to look up. It's not destroyed? It must have changed form! Call me impressed. An opportunity has fallen to our world. We now realize that the Kingdom Stone was never fading, but changing in ways that were transparent to us in our lust for power and prestige. The wind carries its eternal glow to the furthest reaches of our lands, and former enemies extend their hands to one another, acknowledging the error of their ways. Creatures both mutant and metal still ravage the landscape, and it will be some time before we can dispose of them once and for all. Perhaps most troubling of all is that Lord Brevin the monster who threw our world into chaos is nowhere to be found. There is still much work to be done. We are not completely out of danger, but my people and I will rest easy tonight, knowing that the bravery and sacrifice of a select few have given our world another chance. I never got to properly thank you all for helping me. Hey, we're buds. That's what buddies do. Well, on behalf of the Coalition of Planets, you have our sincerest gratitude. Psst, come here, you. <laughs> thank you. So, I guess this is it, huh? I'm gonna miss you. Me too. <laughs> well, who knows? I could be coming back sooner than you think. Until then, just take care of yourselves. The world needs you. See you around, spaceman! Goodbye, Torque! Bye, Torque! See you soon!
don't lose your head. <laughs> okay, so that was Freedom Planet. Honestly, man, I never thought I, well, not never thought, but like, it's one of those things where you, you find out about a project, like, when I consider I found out about this a couple years ago. Like, it feels weird being in this, in this location now, like, this is something I watched from a very early time and, and watched it grow into something that I've thoroughly enjoyed. Like, my god. It's, it's awesome. And I have given them non-stop praise, apart from a few nitpicks here and there, of course. Being their first game, it is astounding to see what they've done here. I'm very impressed with everything. So, big congratulations to those who were involved to make this such an enjoyable experience. And I hope you guys enjoyed the playthrough. I hope you guys enjoyed the videos. I hope I presented them uh, in a adequate way. But, uh, yeah. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Let's play Freedom Planet. I'll see you on, well, whatever I make next. Take care. Okay, thanks. Bye. Actually, uh, pretty good. <laughs>